Hello, once again, Squid of Baconator here. Now the time to talk about Fallout 3. Now, I'm just gonna clarify this right now. Please, by judging by how many of you read the title, and probably already got a bad opinion on me firsthand, and just, I can say one thing. Please be respectful. I, m most of my opinions on this game will be negative, and just be respectful. If you have some arguable things to it, add to this, and be, please feel free to, to go ahead and argue with it, I'd be glad to, but just don't be all hateful with the, oh my god, you hate this game, you suck, it's good, type of comments, I don't tolerate that, alright, just, and also, if you do feel like that, just don't take this too seriously, take it like a grain of salt, just that. Okay, so Fallout 3, pretty much my... I pretty much just got this game recently when I got Fallout 4. I, it came free with Fallout 4, so I thought, hey, that's a good deal. I might as well see how the previous game in the series did in comparing to this. And I gotta say, it really disappointed me. I mean, if you've seen Josh Scorcher's opinion on the Fallout series, then I pretty much share some of the thoughts on that. I think Fallout 3 really is pretty overrated. For, for what it, the praise it gets, even for its time, it just, no, I don't get it. Okay, so what are my problems with it? Well, I can kind of see why people like it. I mean, Fallout 3, 3 just still has a large world with tons of stuff to explore and figure out and find new things, but the problem is, it's really fucking boring. Mainly the big thing uh, from that comes from the graphics, and I, my god, these graphics look hideous. I get that they were trying to go for a sort of a post-apocalyptic feel for this, but it really doesn't work when you only have like three colors on your palette, and pretty much to spread the grays, dark greens, and browns, and blacks throughout the whole areas, the whole map. It's just too ugly to look at, too Bland, too boring, too uninteresting, not wanting me to get into the game. I can't get involved in this game like I can with Fallout 4. And that's pretty much my big reason on being not interested in Fallout 3, but it keeps going on. I will admit, uh, before I go any further, I will say it does have a couple things that it does better than Fallout 4. Um, first off, the dialogue system is a little more complicated and I do like that better, a little bit better than in Fallout 4, and is that really it? Yeah, that's one of the few positives I can think of off the top of my head right now, and another problem I sort of had is with the story. Now, by itself, the story of this kid, this guy following after his father, leaving a vault, and restarting Project Purity, dealing with the Enclave and whatnot. It sounds interesting to begin with. The pre whole premise of everything is pretty good. But the execution, it's a little hard from... In my opinion, it's a little too hard to get involved with these characters and interested in the whole story in general. And also, the ending to this game is pretty anticlimactic. And... With the whole filing Liberty Prime and the Brotherhood of Steel to take back uh, the purifier and sacrificing yourself. It was very anticlimactic because you don't really get to do much, really need to do much of the fighting. You can just use everyone else and you barely have to waste a bullet. And that's just not very good. And also, the way this game is, it's like with the Fallout series... It's like, it is very bad to make it. You can't play the game anymore after it ends. And that is a real... I'm sorry, but that's just a really fucking stupid idea. I mean, they expect you're going to do all the things in the game that you can before playing the ending. And that's just really stupid. And I know they made DLC to allow you to play afterwards, but... I am not going to pay money to play the game even more. That, that really... 
to continue playing the game. That's just really stupid. And, uh, I, I just, and also, it's just hard to say anymore. It's just really disappointing game. And also, the gameplay itself, I feel, is a little too stiff for me, my taste. It, just everything from, like, from the VAT system, pretty much just freezing, feels just annoying how you have to keep stopping in it. gameplay. How I like it better in Fallout 4 where it's still in slow-mo, so there's still a little bit of tension. It's like, in the older games, it's like Fallout 3 in New Vegas. It sort of loses that tension in the gameplay. And it feels very... And also, finding weapons and ammo and stuff feels of, too hard. I can understand that they were trying to make it so you had to scavenge for stuff, but... It's just... The difficulty level on that is too much. It's just very hard to get certain weapons, and which means you're going to keep dying pretty quickly because it's you keep running out of ammo. You only got a couple not very good weapons to choose from. And also, the selection of weapons is a lot more limited. And it just doesn't feel like there's much of a choice on what you use. So it feels like... Unlike with Fallout 4, yeah, I keep comparing this to Fallout 4. I just say that this game, I think, is better than Fallout 3. It's like, in Fallout 4, there are a lot more variety of weapons and a lot more different mods that you can customize your weapons with, which I really wish was incorporated in the older games, too. And just makes it feel like you're just going to use the same exact weapons, same exact things every time and it gets the replay value I guess would be sort of wasted in this and also another little thing that I don't like is pretty much all that waste useless junk it is useless there's pretty much no point in collecting all of it so why bother even having it in the first place it's like at least in Fallout 4 they give a use to all this useless junk you can Mod your weapons, your power armor, building the sanctuaries and settlements and whatnot. It gives a use to all that useless junk. And the older games don't only really have a point in collecting it, so why bother having it in the first place? It's just... I just find Fallout 3 to be really disappointing. I want to like it. I really want to like this series more than I do, but... I don't think I'm gonna get really interested in anything beyond the latest game in this series, because I feel like other than all the glitches that Fallout 4 has, and the dumbed down dialogue, excuse me, the dumbed down dialogue system, that's pretty much the only things I really have, that I have wrong with this game, I think Fallout 4 is a lot better, definitely a big improvement on the series, and so Fallout 3, just too disappointing for me to recommend, I'm sorry, just... Uh, so, what do you think of it? Do you like the game, dislike it, or not? don't really care about it? Like, comment, subscribe, whatnot. Squid of Bacon here, signing out.